Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title of the video today, I'm gonna to go through my newborn essentials, what I did use in this first month with baby Carlo, what we really loved, what really helped us, stuff that we liked, stuff that we didn't like, and I hope that will help you if you have a newborn, if you have a baby, toddler, if you're pregnant, because it's very nice to look at these videos and actually know what you need, what you don't need, what you need to buy. So if you still didn't subscribe, please do hit the notification bell down below if you're into cleaning, decluttering, organizing, hauls, um, lifestyle videos, this is the right channel for you. And without further ado, let's get into the video. But as you can see from my background, I'm still at my parents' house because I'm still renovating my house. We had some delays, delays with deliveries. I obviously was, for the first two weeks, wasn't feeling well as I had quite a bit of a blood loss from my C-section. So I had to recover from that. My husband, he obviously spent a lot of time with me and the baby, so all the house projects got a bit delayed, but we're back on track. So hopefully we can move in next month. Hence why I'm here and I'm filming here and hence why there's no cleaning videos. I miss filming my cleaning videos so much. Can't wait to do them again and yeah, but don't worry, as soon as we will be in the new house, obviously a lot of home videos, but mainly cleaning videos because I know this is what my channel is about. So a lot of cleaning needs to be done in the house and a lot of cleaning videos coming next month. So let's go through my most used products. I have a list here. I'm probably gonna make this video into two videos because this video is like, I have 500 products. So I will probably do two videos. So I'm gonna go through random things, like could be like bad things, toys, nursery, whatever. So first thing that I'm really loving at the moment is this Fisher Price Baby Gym. I'm gonna insert the products like videos here on the side because everything is very big and obviously I can't bring it upstairs. So obviously for some tummy time, I um, bought a little gym. I went on Amazon. There's loads of nice gyms like on Mamas and Papas, whatever. Um, but you can buy whatever you want. I really like this one because I had a little pillow for tummy time, a few toys, I had a little teddy bear with like a lot of song songs. My baby boy loves the little teddy bear that you can play all different songs and sounds. He really loves sounds. Um, in fact, he really loves like <laughs> the Hoover, the washing machine. We always put them in the laundry room, but he really loves that kind of stuff. Stuff. Um, so some of them are very expensive, but this was fine. From 50 euro, I paid it 45. The thing that I did love for me was such a good buy and essential is this baby scale right here. So reason why I bought baby scale, obviously I'm used that in Italy, you bring your baby to the pediatrician, they wait um, like loads of times, especially when they're newborn. In Ireland, you just bring your baby to, obviously when he's in the hospital, two week, checkup, six week checkup, that's it. So you don't really know how much they weigh until the nurse comes to your house, but especially because my baby, he was born at 2.7 kilos. He was quite small, because obviously I was actually just turning 37 weeks, not even. So I really want to know, like obviously because he was tiny, thank God I had this scale. So another great buy, absolutely love this, I actually bought two, is this newly bottle warmer, we bought a bottle warmer. Everyone does it different. Some people boil kettle, some people uh, warm water and the bottle in like a bowl. Uh, I bought a bottle warmer. If we are outside, you can use different things. But um, see, a lot of people use those prep machines where you actually put the formula, the water, and it does everything yourself. I think those are good, but I didn't really like the idea of the formula being in there, and I just like making it myself. So bottle warmers, you can find some very expensive one online. Wouldn't really bother with that. Amazon, I paid this one 39 euro. This is so good. I bought two of them. There's different settings. You can warm up your milk, thawing, food eating. You can sterilize your bottles or suitors in this. Um, so I always sterilize the suitors, um, like the pacifiers. You can warm up their food if they're eating. Uh, you can choose the temperature. Currently my milk, cause he's drinking five ounces, will warm up in five minutes. So quite fast. Um, you plug it in. I have one upstairs for the nighttime, one downstairs for the daytime. 39 euro, so good. Like there's some very expensive ones online and I just don't understand. Like my sister got another one. I'm gonna put a picture here again on Amazon. That was so good. And she had it for like three years. So you don't really need to spend 200 euro. And this is so good. Like, you know, instead of like boiling the water, you don't know if it's too hot, if it's cold, like this will give you the right temperature. Obviously always test it on your wrist. 
but you don't really have to get a headache like oh is it warm is it cold i feel this is so handy so another thing that i did buy great buy for me this is a must-have if you have a baby even toddlers it's a thermometer a uh, reason why I bought a thermometer is because I was actually quite sick. All my family was quite sick when the baby was just born. Well, not maybe like two weeks after. So I just said, I'll just buy a thermometer. You never know, he could get something. Always nice to have one at home if you feel he has a temperature instead of running everywhere. And we add those adult thermometers where you put it in front of your face, but I think those don't work on babies. Whereas these are very accurate because you can either put it in their mouth, under their arm, or in their bum. So it will give you a very accurate temperature. I feel certain things when it comes to health, um, when they're older, like cow and uh, nasal sprays, thermometers, colic drops, all this kind of stuff, always have some, like we, even for us that we're adults, we have a space in the home, my house, my parents' house, where we have many medicines. Could be like stuff for your headache, stuff for anything, like if you, stomach pain, instead of running everywhere. So this is very good. This was actually on a sale from like 50 euro. I paid it 11 euro. I was shocked. Um, there's three settings, zero to three months, three to 36 months, 36 plus months. It tells you what their temperature should be. So there's like a green light, yellow, and red. It tells you when it's dangerous, when the baby's fine. Um, you put it under their arm, one minute it will beep. Also brown is such a good um, brand for these type of things like thermometers, like they're so good. Um, but always good to have this in the house. Thank God we didn't really have to use it, but you never know, might, you might get temperature, um, you're home, you wanna know. By the way, sorry if you hear some noise, baby is in the room with me sleeping and makes a lot of noise when he sleeps, when he dreams. So another thing, uh, guys, a lot of the things that you see in this video are, my sister told me to buy them because she has a baby boy, toddler boy, and a lot of the stuff is what she used, so yes, because most of the things I didn't even know what they were and she told me to buy them very handy for example this tommy tippy thermos here um reason why i uh portable bottle warmer but it's very good to have these um you boil your water in your kettle put it in this thermos literally will stay hot for like five six hours and then you have this plastic um container you put the water in your container and you can uh warm up your bottle if you're bringing food in like a little container for your toddler um, and you lock it, it's very safe and just warm up food or milk for your baby or toddler. This was 17 euro on Amazon. I love that Tommy Tippy does a lot of these like things as, as well as bottles, like um, all these gadgets that are very handy. This is so good. Like when we went to Dublin for shopping, we went for lunch last week. I actually asked for hot water at the restaurant and they did give it to me, but not everywhere you get hot water. So if you know, maybe you might go in a place where they don't give it to you or you don't find it, um, just bring that in your car and you can warm up your milk on the go. A lot of people give cold milk. I really like to give warm milk just because better with the colleagues, but if I had to get cold, I would, you know? But good to have that in your car, just put it there and the water will stay actually um, hot for ages. For example, before on planes, flights, they used to give you warm water. Don't do that anymore because new rules. So it's nice to have one of those things if you have a long flight or. So another thing that I love is the, again from Tommy Tippy, our, my sister told me about these, didn't even know what they were. These Tommy Tippy powder, um, dispensers you get six of them what they basically are let's say you're going out instead of bringing your big powder box you can measure i don't know like your baby takes five scoops of formula milk you put five scoops in these containers and when you take one little container out you know it's five scoops open it throw it in the bottle with the water and you know that's five scoops a lot of people use them for nighttime as well because when you wake up the baby cries instead of like measuring the scoops you have these ready i don't at night time because i'm quite awake but if you're someone that maybe like i don't know is very sleepy and you don't want to count but these are very good instead of like you i just like last sunday we went for lunch and i brought a few of these with the milk already measured inside so i know how many scoops were in each of one of them and they're very tiny so you very you open them throw them in your bottle and these were eight euro so these are so handy like but this is a bigger version um like if you're traveling my sister actually gave me hers it's this little container for your milk so it's a little container and you actually get a little spoon as well so you can measure up your milk this is very handy if you're again if you're spending maybe a full day out i don't know like a few days you're going on holidays um, maybe you have your big um 
optimal box in your suitcase but you can put this in your backpack uh, this was 11 euro so very handy for um, storing your powder milk on the go because obviously those box are so big and all these little things are so good for like traveling like if you're like me that we travel a lot we go out a lot for like meals and stuff like that you want to make it as easier as you can especially if you travel with kids so all these little gadgets are so good another thing that i'm loving and she's here beside me is this little light uh i love to sleep with blackout lights like we have blackout curtains here absolutely love pitch black not even a drop of light my husband loves to sleep with the light but he doesn't anymore because i don't but obviously we have table lamps here beside us I feel they're very bright and I can't sleep with them. So we said, a lot of babies like the dark, a lot of babies like the light. I said, why not buy a little light? Maybe like he feels comfortable. Obviously I'm not gonna turn on the table lamps cause they're so bright and I won't be able to sleep with them. So I bought one of these on Amazon and um, absolutely love them. I actually saw a woman with them, with this in hospital. And I said, mm. and this is so good because it gives a little bit of light but you can still sleep. And this comes from someone that sleeps in pitch black. So you turn it on. Now, this, you can't even see it. This is the one I put on um, because obviously this is like number one. You can put it higher, higher, different colors. I put the first setting, which is very low, and then you can charge it with a little charger, um, like a USB charger. This is so nice. I put it up there and it gives you a little bit of light, like even if we're looking at him or maybe he turns and looks at us because this room, these curtains are proper black, like to the point that if you walk to go to the toilet, you can't see. So it's nice to have one of these. Put it up here on the bed and you just charge it like the, I never ran out of the battery. Like I <laughs> just charge it myself. Like the battery is very long. How much did I pay this? 15 euro. It's on a sale from 22 to 15. So nice to have one of them. Like these are all little things that just make your life easier in your room. For example, another thing that makes your life easier is this baby car mirror. I bought this when I was actually in the hospital because I drive a lot. Uh, obviously at the start, I sat behind with him because obviously I had no car mirror, but even if I want to sit on the front with my husband, going out for a meal, we can just see him at the mirror. I drive loads by myself. Baby will be loads of times by himself with me in the car so instead of like stressing out, obviously, especially when they're that young and you don't know what they're doing and obviously they're facing the back, um, you can just see. Now, this is very cute. I paid this 11 euro. You just attach it to your car seat and you can just see your baby. A lot of people use um, cameras uh, for baby. I don't know, like it's nice, but I just feel like I wouldn't really spend that amount of money, but I did see people on TikTok with this. Um, and it seems very good. Like maybe like if you do very long drives, but well, we do long drives as well, but I feel like the mirror is enough. Like you can see what happens in the mirror just for 10 euro. So let's go ahead. Another buy that I did love. Again, I bought this when I was pregnant because I did a lot of research to have all these things. It's this little duck for his little bat. Obviously it's very handy to just put your hand in the water and feel if it's hot or not totally fine but a lot of times maybe for us it might be fine maybe the baby's a bit more delicate especially if they're very tiny like him so if you want to be a bit more relaxed you can just buy one of these i paid this 10 euro you put it in your bat and it tells you the temperature temperature should always be around 37 degrees when it gets too hot it will flash and say hot so you know the water is too hot or it drops the temperature it you can just see and then you can just give it back to your baby gives you a peace of mind maybe if you're insecure um there's different animals on amazon you can buy different shapes i bought this little duck for 10 euro uh, but again i know it with my hand when it's too warm so another thing that obviously i've been loving this was a present from my sister and brother-in-law is my snooze pod i will put a video here when i was pregnant i said what crib what cot and i went with this snooze pod we have a bigger cot uh, my nursery reveal video hopefully will come up soon because we will have a huge nursery and baby boy will be transferred to his nursery when he's around six months where it's safe to sleep by himself. Obviously the first six, seven months, they have to sleep beside you on the bed because obviously it's dangerous and they have a smaller cot. Once they'll be able to sleep by themselves, not dangerous, he can go on to his nursery and we can't wait. The nursery will be the room in front of our bedroom in our new home. And, and this cot will fit him for six, seven months. So yes, so snooze pod is very good. I got this gray one. Uh, there's different functions. There's like a recliner function for reflux. I didn't put that on. I just have like a little towel under his mattress. Um, but if your baby suffer from reflux, you can even add this function. They're around like 250 euro. Pricey, but so nice. There's a function on the side where you can zip and open. I don't have that, mine is all together. 
but a lot of people have this thing. Maybe if you breastfeed and you put your baby in the bed with you, but because I always bottle feed them on a chair, I don't really need the zip, but you can add the zip. Um, really loving this and you can like rock it as well, like push it and it will rock. He loves the rocking function. So that was such a good buy. Again, they only use it for six, seven months because then they go into bigger cut, but you can always put it in their box and I'll put it in the attic and use it for another baby. Um, it comes with a little mattress. My sister bought me a mattress protector from Snooze Bot, mattress sheets. So it's very professional, very nice, such a good investment. Now there's so many good next to me cribs, cots. I just went with snooze bot, I think because my sister had it and like a lot of friends had it. Um, so yeah, but another present that I loved was from my parents. Again, when I was, sorry, I'm looking at my phone for the product. Um, pregnant, my parents bought me, uh, they want to buy me a push chair stroller set. They asked me, well, I went to Mama's and Papa's in Blanche and I tried so many push chair stroller sets um, and I went with this one, the Okaro set. There were so many different brands. Like I just went with this one because I really liked the style. I liked when I tried it, a lot of good reviews. So I like that these came in different sets. Um, so the one that I have, it's the Okaro push chair. I love the color because you can use it with like boy and girl, easy to clean. So my set came with the push chair. So the actual chair where he will sit when he's around like five, six months where he doesn't fit in the bassinet anymore. So obviously still not using that. The carry cot, so the bassinet, where, which we're using now even for like daytime sleeping. It will usually fit in there until they're like five months. Out TI car seat, and that's why I love this because the all the sets from Mamas and Papas, but the car seat is from Cybex. This by itself would actually be very expensive. So it's very nice that you get this in the set and you get the seat base as well. This seat is very like nice, very safe, different functions to turn it, um, very easy to bring for like a mum. Then I got a backpack and instead of the backpack, we add like a changing mat, a little like thermos flask. Um, we got the foot muff. So it's like this huge thing made out of fur where you can put your baby in when you're going for walks in the push chair. I got a cup holder, I got a raincoat cover. I don't remember how much my parents paid this, but I think around 1,500, 1,600. But it's a big set. Now, there's even more expensive sets online from other brands. I just went with this one because I really liked it. Um, now, it is quite heavy, like the wheels are big. I got a pram with big wheels. I know it could be a bit because it's hard to carry, but we go for walk. We live in the countryside, so I needed something with big wheels that will not get destroyed. Um, now, for traveling, I won't use this stroller. I will buy one of those travel strollers on Amazon for when I go Italy and when I go holidays. Two main reasons, easy to bring around, they're not very big, and on Ryanair, they destroy your strollers. I'm not gonna bring my expensive one there, so I don't mind if I get a cheap one on Amazon that they can just throw everywhere. So I will show you that when I buy that. Um, so yeah, but this has been so good. It is a bit heavy, obviously, for a woman to carry that, but all strollers are. Obviously, the car seat is heavy, the wheels are heavy, but you just get used to it. But I really like all these things. The backpack, like it's such a nice present, like the set, the foot muff, the cup holder. I really like mine, so easy to clean. And yeah, so far we've been loving it, going for a walk. Um, again, the car seat, it's so nice as the base. It's very safe. I actually need to buy another car seat for my other car. So for backpacks, I have two backpacks. One was the one that came in my set. Always good to have one for both care, uh, one for you, one for your husband. Another good backpack, I'm gonna insert a video here, was gifted to me by my sister-in-laws. This is so good because it adds so much space, so many compartments for your bottles, changes, um, anything that you use. And it opens very wide. So I've been loving this backpack so much. I've been using it everywhere. You need to have a backpack, obviously, when you go with a baby, you just put it down your stroller uh, because you need to bring like changes, bottles, nappies, suitors, so you need a big bag. So I wouldn't, but like you can use, either use a normal backpack, but the maternity ones are so good. So this one has been so good. And I, along with the mamas and papas one, other silly things, nappy bags. My favorite nappy bags are from Dunce and from Mr. Price. I love to use nappy bags because um, if I'm not at home, like I'm eating out in a restaurant, they're fragrance. You can put your nappies there and obviously you don't smell the urine, the poo. It's nice to throw them anywhere you are and you can just tie them. Those are my two favorite ones. Nappy bin, I was gifted when I was pregnant, the angel care nappy bin. 
absolutely love um, that. Uh, mine was gifted from Angel Care, but the actual price on Boots is 35 euro. Uh, on Amazon is 29 euro. You really need a nappy bin if you have a baby, especially for throwing nappies in your room, because either are either you get a nappy bin or you have to go outside and throw them out in your actual bin. Um, nappy bin, such a good investment. Like I'm telling you, he does so many poos, so many dirty nappies. We don't smell anything in here. Obviously we empty it out every time it's full, but you don't smell anything. Whereas if you throw a dirty nappy in a regular bin, bin you will, cause their poo is so strong. Invest in a nappy bin, like it really locks the other, like the angel care, it's so good. And the bags last for ages. I think one set like bags like this, these blue things here, they fit 180 nappies, so that will last you for ages. These bin um, bags for the bin, when they're finished, I just buy them on Amazon. I think a set of six of 180 nappies each was 30 euro, so you can just buy the refills on Amazon. This was such a good buy. Angel Care also sent me their bat seat. This was such another good thing because on Mamas and Papas is 32 euro. Many bat seats are so good. You can put pick whatever you want. I love this one. I know everyone has this one and Angel Care sent it to me. You can buy it on Mamas and Papas. Why I love this, we have a huge bat. They're in the new home and in, the, in my parents' home, their bat is huge. So you can't really put the baby in there. These seats are so good because the baby actually sits in it because obviously when they're newborn, they're not gonna sit by themselves. And it's so hard to like, a lot of people maybe hold their baby with one hand and wash them. Whereas with this seat, you can use both your hands and he's just gonna sit there. Um, now I need to buy a big bat that I can put in my parents' bat and the seat in it because their bat is huge. But it's so nice this seat because he, ju he just sits there and I can wash him around and it really holds his head. Uh, I've been loving it. Oh yeah, the man bottles. This was another good buy. When I was pregnant, I actually got a Nuke bottle set. Nuke bottles are so good, but I never used them because then a lot of friends, my sister, my parents were like, you should try the mom. Everyone speaks about the mom. And I ended up buying the mom bottles. Um, love them because obviously they're anti-colic. Uh, baby suffers with colic a little bit and they are so easy to clean. I They come with like a teat size number one. I actually bought separate the teat size zero because he was drinking so fast. But what I love about these bottles as you guys may know it's that they're you can self sterilize them so instead of like buying a steri um, sterilizer basically how these bottles work you pour some water on the bottom put the teeth put the actual bottle and the lid and you can sterilize them in the microwave for like three minutes and then it's like extra minute for each bottle so you don't really need to invest in a sterilizer you can sterilize them in your microwave i actually add a sterilizer from tommy tippy because i didn't know this um, but I had a microwave sterilizer. I'm gonna show you what they look like this. I bought this actually in Aldi for like 15 euro, but it looks like this, but I'm probably still gonna use this in my new home because maybe to sterilize like little toys when he put his teeth, um, his sutures. So you use this in the microwave with some water. But for the bottles, you don't need any sterilizer. Now, a lot of vests in sterilizer, they're like 200 euro, this kind of stuff. I don't think you need that. If you have these type of bottles, you can sterilize in the microwave. If you want a sterilizer for your dummies, anything else, microwave sterilizer from Tommy Tippy, 15 euro. Pour some water, put it in the microwave with everything inside, and it does sterilize. When it comes to suitors, I'm trying the MAM suitors, and I've been loving them, but they're quite big for my baby yet. So I'm still using some premature suitors that I got in the hospital. They're this one here, so if your baby has a smaller mouth, he was born a bit early like mine because the mam ones are still a bit big for him absolutely loving these sutures and he's been loving them um he loves those sutures that i've been loving is this one here this is his lumber slack um uh, sleeping bag so at the start because in the hospital they used to swaddle him i swaddled the baby with the blankets but he moves a lot swaddling can be hard because if he moves a lot like mine blanket will go on his face suffocate the baby suffocates and no Better to get a sleeping bag, you can just rest your head and sleep. Now, a lot of people swaddles their babies in those swaddle bags where their arms are like this. My baby absolutely hates that because he loves to have his arms out. Baby boy here, waking up from his feet, wants to be part of this video. Does he? So yeah, problem with the sleeping bags that you can get anywhere is that they're quite big. And obviously because he was born a bit early, what you have to make sure is that his neck is perfect. Like his head doesn't go inside and then he suffocates. So my sister actually sent me this brand that's called Slumber Sack and they do sleeping bags for newborn babies that are a bit smaller. And that newborn bag fits them perfectly. It was so good. I paid a 25 euro, I think. Now I didn't know that with uh, sleeping bags you can 
choose different togs what does that mean it depends on the material so a one tog would be light 1.5 heavier two tog heavier depending on how many degrees you got in your house i got some heavier ones but i'm going to use them in the winter i'm using a 1.5 now because my parents house is quite hot and at 1.5 i think it's from 18 degrees to 22 23 so this house because it has underfloor heating and we can see the temperature on the wall it's quite hot but maybe older houses that are quite cold, you can use like a two, a 2.5. But what I love about this sleeping bag is that it's designed for newborns. So it's quite small, so it fits them perfectly, whereas the other ones, uh, maybe it would have went on his face and he suffocates. But sleeping bag, it's so good. With swaddling with blankets, you just have to be careful because when they start moving, blankets go on their face and it's quite dangerous. Whereas with this, so yeah, so he's actually smiling right now. So slumber sack, love the material. It washes very easily. Um, I can need, put it in the tumble dryer it doesn't get smaller love that so guys i'm gonna go now because all my family's here for lunch and i'm actually here i will make a second video because i have so many more items to show you but this video would have been five hours long so yes so i need to cut it but this is the end of the video i hope this helps someone that's pregnant these videos are so good because obviously you can look online but it's so hard to know what to buy especially if you're first time mom like me obviously my family my sister told me many of the things but it's nice to know what i actually needed for him all little things that when you go out when you travel you just need and it's nice and everything on amazon so nice like a few days and it's in your house love that so yes and i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for keeping me company with me and baby c that's here <laughs> and he's loving life loves to hear when i speak and make videos and we're just gonna go downstairs for food and thank you for keeping us company and i'll see you in my next video bye, -bye.